What's up guys, Sick Crazy here. Today I'm bringing you guys a Black Ops 2 game where uh, on up blank I go 20 and 6. Sorry, I didn't spawn in there. Uh, this is from theater, obviously. Um, I actually just got the game literally right before this. Uh, I wasn't recording because I was rendering on another video and then the video finished rendering in the middle of the game. That's why in, a, uh, in the middle of the game you'll see me stop walking and I'm just clicking close and going on YouTube and uploading that. Uh, that was yesterday's video, um, and then I decided I would record this game real quick and make a video, obviously. Um, so, anyway, what I wanted to talk about was songs, uh, and my favorite song right now. Um, so, first of all, my favorite artist is Eminem. Um, Overall, his lyrics are good, his songs have meaning, um, and any song uh, where the lyrics aren't really that good has a good beat, any song really does have a good beat for Eminem, um, but he definitely is really good and deserves all the respect he has, so yeah. Um, my favorite song right now, my favorite modern song. That's on, that plays on the radio. I don't, I don't know if it plays on the radio. I listen to Spotify or um, my parents and my sister like XTU, which is a local country station. So, anyway, um, so I never listen to like Q102 or anything, but I'm pretty sure it's on MMR sometimes. It's called Sail by AWOL Nation. I think that's how you say it, AWOL Nation. Um, the song's really good, uh, beat's really good, so, I like that song. My favorite song altogether from any time frame is probably Don't Let Me Fall by B.O.B., um, at, or, uh, All She Wrote by T.I. featuring Eminem. Uh, my favorite Eminem song is, I'm debating on Going Through Changes, um, you're never over or not afraid. Um, so yeah, that's that's my taste in music. I'm I'm a huge rap fan. Um, I don't like the ghetto rap stuff like Lil Wayne, Rick Ross, uh, Birdman, T Two Chains, um, Wiz Khalifa, stuff like that. I like basically the only rap artists I really like are the no name artists like Logic. Well, not no name artists, but. The ones that aren't on the radio, like Logic, Hoodie Allen, um, Eddie B and Tim Gunter. Well, they're broken up now, but so it's just Eddie B. Um, and then um, the artists that are on the radio, like I said, Eminem is my favorite. Um, I like what's his name, B.O.B. Uh, so yeah, that's really my taste in music. I, li I like. I'm. I'm very diverse with what I like. See, right, right here is where I'm closing out of the video. Um, so, yeah, like, I, I really am diverse. Um, I, a lot of people think it's weird how many, like, how I like almost any genre. It doesn't, I don't like just a specific genre. Um, even rap is my favorite, and then in a close second is rock, and then third I'd probably say is country. Um, I don't like the hardcore country like Blake Shelton. I don't, I don't really like Blake Shelton. Uh, I like like Tim McGraw, Luke Bryan, somewhat, some songs by Keith Urban and Toby Keith. Um, and... Florida Georgia Line's okay. I don't know if you'd consider them country or not, but yeah. So that's really how I feel about music. Uh, comment down uh, below if what what your favorite genre is, who your favorite artist is, what your favorite song is, whatever you want about music. Um, and you may not agree with my tastes. That's completely your opinion. I I get that. Just please respect my opinion. Um, that's all I ask. Uh, so, yeah, that's, like, music, I really love music, uh, honestly, I used to actually, with 
Nate or Sick Twist. We used to have a quote unquote rap group. If you could see me, I'm doing air quotes. Um, I wrote really crappy lyrics. Nate wrote pretty pretty good lyrics. We called it NDAI, which stood for no doubt about it. Uh, all I basically wrote about was how I like Grammys. I played that so smart there. I just went pro and let the guy run past me and then killed him from behind. Um, so anyway, our rap group was called No Doubt About It. Um, I wrote really stupid lyrics about how, uh, no doubt about it, our name's known. You look like a 200-year-old toad or something like that was one of my lines. And another was, talk trash, I don't care, I got that Grammy on the shelf or something like that. It made no sense, my lyrics. But Nate had some pretty good ones, like, um, I put you to sleep like you with borders. Or no, um, I read you like a book like you with borders put you to sleep I call that doctor's orders or something like that like he had he had lyrics that made sense were kinda of funny stuff like that um, it's true I'm the key to all awesomeness call me spaghetti and try to put some sauce in this Is that that's one of his most known lines that I remember so yeah so anyway guys comment like subscribe follow me on twitter will be down in the description below and as always guys this has been sick crazy and I'll see you guys in the next video Thanks for watching.